it's time to learn a new secret. There are many word trains in a sentence. Most of the word trains have an engine that pulls the train. But some word trains don't have an engine, and while reading, they need to be connected to a word train before it. Let's see an example. There are two word trains in this verse. The first word train has an engine, but the second one doesn't. So, we need to connect the second word train to the first one and read it as one word. Like alhamdu. Even though kind swan and lazy goose are in two different words, they get connected and read as one syllable. Kel. Do you know how to find out if a word train has an engine or not? When a word train doesn't have an engine, it starts with a pole and a special symbol on top of it. The special symbol looks like a fish head. We will call this symbol a connector. Here is another example. Do you see the connector in this verse? Yes. It is at the start of the second word. So, we connect the second word to the first one and read it as Min al Even though new moon and lazy goose are in two different words, they get connected and read as one syllable. Nal. Now it's your turn. Min al well done, mashallah. Make sure you don't confuse the connector and the separator symbols. Although both symbols have a pole below, they look different on top. The connector looks like a fish head, while the separator looks like a circle. Also, the separator appears at the end of words, while the connector appears at the start. You got it! Alhamdulillah! Now we're going to read more verses with the connector. Wal-Asri Bil-Fatihati Humul Muflihoon Ma-Lal-Yatimi Fantastic! 